Welcome back to Tourist Tuesday. This week we're off to visit another historic site that is important not only to our Kansas history, but also to American history. We're traveling the Santa Fe Trail this week. Let's head on out. Santa Fe Trail was a 19th century international trading route started by entrepreneur William Becknell in 1821 to help him get out of debt. It did just that and helped Becknell, as well as many other traders, become quite wealthy. It connected Independence, Missouri to Santa Fe, New Mexico, which was then in Mexico, to trade needed goods such as cloth, fur, needles, axes, knives, buttons, tools, gold, mules, and much, much more. The trail stretched diagonally across Kansas, and travel on this nearly 900-mile trail was quite difficult for various reasons. The weather was extremely hot and dry in the summer with very cold winters. Food and water was often scarce along the trail, making the travel quite risky. Traders quickly learned that traveling in caravans was the safest bet for them, especially with the risk of raids by the groups of local Indians. The safety of traders passing through was one of the reasons why frontier forts in Kansas were set up. With numerous heavy wagons carrying loads of trade goods over the same land, deep wagon ruts were left behind. There are several locations across Kansas where you can still visibly see these wagon ruts left over 200 years ago. We have visited the Santa Fe Trail ruts still visible outside of Dodge City and then the Blackjack ruts near Baldwin, which are in the pictures here. It's amazing that these are still visible today, and they are great pieces of history to see in person. See you next week for another new episode.